Yeah, first, I just want to thank uh, Miss Benson, uh, Mickey Loomis, and Coach Payton, and the rest of the coaching staff. It's uh, you know, super exciting to be back for a fourth year, and uh, you know, playing in New Orleans has been you know pretty awesome for the first three. So I'm excited to be back. All right, if you guys have a question, just go ahead and type it in the chat, and I'll call on you. First one's going to be from John DeShazer. Will, how have you um, adapted as, to your role as you've grown in the Saints system? Really just been, you know, trying to do everything I can just to get on the field. The, uh, you know, when I first got here, our offense line was pretty loaded, and I realized, you know, just from, you know, always been able to play guard and center, I'd have to do that, obviously, in a backup role. But, you know, then taking on the jumbo tight end role as well in certain games and uh, really just being there for whatever the team needs. Uh, that's just kind of how you survive in a backup role in the league. And, you know, I'm just trying to, you know, keep getting better and, uh, you know, eventually uh, earn a starting job. Amos Morrell. Yeah, did you have uh, any or explore any other opportunities and what made this a place you wanted to come back to and play? Yeah, I mean, we, uh, we looked around, but there was nothing that uh, I felt like, you know, was better than the Saints offer in terms of what they're offering on top of uh, just what my role would be. And uh, obviously the Saints, you know, have a special place in my heart, and I'm glad I could be back with them. Amy Just. Yeah, welcome back. Um, your role last year changed a little bit um, from the year before. Um you were, you know, sometimes a healthy scratch. Um, how did you balance that and knowing that this is a place you want to be, but you're probably not playing as much as you'd want to? Yeah, I mean, it's just a competition every year. The, uh, you know, there's nothing guaranteed in this league. And uh, week in and week out, you got to prove it. Uh, last year, obviously, it was a down year for me from playtime uh, perspective, just from my second year to my third year. And uh, I look forward to, you know, earning that time back and, you know, being one of the guys uh, that we can rely on. Luke Johnson. Well, uh, I'm curious what your uh, your kind of feeling is getting a chance to work with uh, Brendan Nugent as your kind of full time offensive line coach. Now, what, what do you think? Uh, what do you think that's going to be like for you guys? Yeah, I think Nugent is a great coach. Uh, obviously, you know the past few years, teams have tried to go get him, and uh, Coach Payton obviously keeps making him a priority to keep him around just because of how great of a coach he is. And I'm very excited just to have him in a, you know, full-time role. He's a great coach. He, uh, he really understands just like, you know, getting us in the right techniques for each individual person. You know, everybody does something a little different. And, uh, you know, he, he works with us and talks us through it. And, you know, just the way he views the game is, uh, is great uh, for a coaching standpoint. And, you know, we're glad to have him. Amos Morrell. And not only is the uh, coaching staff going to look a little different, but, uh, you know, the offensive room, uh, side of the ball is going to look different, going to have a new quarterback. Have you thought much about, you know, uh, what it's going to be like playing with Jameis and, or Taysom, depending on who, you know, wins the job? Yeah, I mean, I think there'll be obviously slight differences just from, you know, Drew to Taysom to Jameis or whoever it is. And honestly, but I think you'll see the core of the offense stay the same. Uh, all those guys are, uh, you know, great, great quarterbacks. And obviously Taysom does some different things than Jameis would and vice versa. But I think the uh, the core of the offense will definitely stay the same. Uh, we didn't lose, you know, that many core players. And, you know, I'm excited to come back to a team that pretty much, you know, has everything back. 